Hey guys, um, I actually made a previous video on how to open a OneDrive account. I also show you guys how to upload um, songs and files on OneDrive account, okay? So basically, um, these two files right here are the files that we actually uploaded on OneDrive account. And um, these are the files I'll be using to demonstrate this lecture. And this lecture is um, just how to get direct download links from OneDrive, okay? And also how to embed contents from OneDrive to your website. Okay, so having made uh, this um, introduction, let's proceed to our lecture. So in our OneDrive account, we have two files uploaded. One of the files is a music file. And how you could know is from the icons, okay? So from the icon, you could see a music note there. That shows that it's a music file. All right, so next um, we have a PDF file. Okay, so from the icon, you could see there's a paper with a folded edge. Okay, that shows that it's a, P, uh, it's a PDF file. Okay, it could be PDF file, PPT file, Word file. Okay, it's all documents. So if I want to actually get the direct download links to these files, it's just to click here. When you click here, uh, maybe you want to get a direct download link and share it to somebody. You could just click here, click on copy. When you click on copy, click on copy. Okay, then maybe I want to send it to somebody on WhatsApp. I could just uh, paste it, all right? And once the person clicks this direct download link, it will bring him to the file. When the person has come to the file here, the person can just click on download. To actually, uh, the person can actually click on download to actually download this file, okay? You see that it has downloaded already, okay? So that's how to get the direct download link on uh, on what on on OneDrive, okay? So if I want to get this direct download link to my website, okay? So when it is on my website, I won't really um, want people to actually click the OneDrive link, and it will also it will bring them back to the OneDrive. No, I want people to just when they click this on um, the website, the file is, di is, is downloading what? Directly. Okay, so I'll be teaching you guys this trick because normally um, OneDrive is built in a way that when you click a direct download link, it will still bring you back to the website. So I'll be teaching you guys how to actually bypass this. Okay, so now coming to a website I actually created to um, teach you guys stuff. So I'll open it up. Um, let's say um this song right here is actually um uh, the song that i uploaded on my OneDrive. okay uh, let me bring it here let me say this song right here is a song i uploaded on my OneDrive. now let me open this song on the website too sorry this is like the website homepage. let me open this song go so when i open this song on the website okay all right you could see that this place at the write-up is pink is where i'm supposed to put the direct download link so let me say this is a song I uploaded on my OneDrive and I want to actually get the direct download link to the song. Uh, let me remove the direct download link here first. So, so I've removed it. Okay, I've removed it. Let me refresh and you can confirm that the pink color will turn into normal black. Okay, let me refresh. Can I see that? Okay. Okay, sorry, I've not updated. Okay. So I've updated the post now. When I come to refresh, you see that the pink color will turn into black. Okay. So trying to get the direct download link to um, OneDrive. Okay. If you want to get it in such a way that somebody is clicking it and it's not actually bringing the person back here. Okay. So um, you can just go here. When you go here, click on embed. Okay. So when you click on embed, it's like this. You say generate HTML code. Okay, so when you generate HTML code, all right, you are to copy the HTML code. When you copy it, go back to your WPS, all right, then um, create a Word blank document. When you create a Word blank document, paste it. So when you paste it, guys, you are to copy from this HTML in quotes to the end of the quote. I hope you guys have seen it. There's a quote there. Oh, sorry. There's a quote there. I copied from the beginning towards the end. Let me let me make it large. All right. Can you see that I copy it? Let me copy again from the beginning to the end. Okay. When I copy it out, 
I'll space it down, I'll paste. As it is placed embed, embedded, I'll clear it and I'll type download. Okay, that's me changing the command there. Okay, it's actually the command there was embedded to so that somebody click it to go back to the embed form. But I'm changing the, 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 the command there so that the person can be able to download it directly. So when I go to my website, I'll go to the post, okay? I'll click here, go to my link to, then I'll apply this, this link, okay? That actually changed the authority. So I'll update. When I update, I'll come here, refresh. Okay, when I refresh, when I click here to download something, can you see that it will start downloading directly? It will start downloading directly, okay? I will not um, redirect the person to the website, okay? So that's it about um, I'm getting a direct download link from OneDrive, okay? Then if I want to embed this um, post on my website, still come to Embedded. When you come to Embedded, copy the embed link. Okay, so now you actually want to embed it and you don't really need to change any commands or whatsoever. Okay, so now um, take a note. You can just like um, stream here. Just write stream here. Uh, make it bold. All right, so when you write stream here, come to this place, go to the HTML view. Where is the stream here? Just locate stream here amongst this right hook. And here is stream here, then space down. When you space down, paste it. When you paste it, come back. Okay. When you come back, you see it like this. You could see an embed here, right? Now, just update this post. When you update this post, go back to your website. And it's loading up. Now, uh, let's see something. Well, that's the embed, okay? And when somebody clicks it, it will come to this side and start playing. Okay? Once somebody clicks it, it will come to this side and start playing. Okay? Okay? So that's it, guys. I hope you guys um love this tutorial. See you guys in the next tutorial. And bye for now.